Hey guys, um, I've just started another uh, regular session. I, I will play some uh, Ultimate and Joker um, because a lot of people are asking about um, whether I can uh, upload some videos about those games. So yeah, I, I will, but um, I my my default uh, game of choice would be either regular or progressive uh, especially with the current uh, global lockdown si situation seems like um, traffic is better everywhere so queen is dead I don't have a better play seven is dead too So I'll play more of um, regular and progressive and occasionally I'll play ultimate and joker. So it's my first time playing with uh, these two opponents but I think at least the guy on the left should be a weaker player I think he had, he had like a 6 uh, on, on the top on the first pool for no reason so 7 diamonds left I think I will just play the trips I'll play the jack, uh, okay one jack, three aces, three queens, so I will just, I think I will unlock the jack, lock the jack in the middle, so free rolling for the two outer queen and like case aces, Pocket tens, pocket nines, nope, no pocket nines. So um if if you don't have your YouTube subtitles on, you can turn them on by um clicking on the CC um settings should be like below right just below the um, video like time time bar thingy so this is a nice pool like so I have like um, five direct outs right away. Gonna play the this life card. Let's make it eight outs. Um, so eight outs. This is basically heads up because we can see one guy's cards. So eight outs is like uh, eighty three percent from OOP. Whereas 5 outs was like 65% from OOP in the heads up chart, so it's almost a 20% um, gain. I'm gonna play the queen in the middle because um, the fantasy land guy cannot have kings because all 4 kings are out. But he might have aces and some pair.
So like I always tell people, um, part of the reason why I don't like to play uh, ultimate and progressive, I mean ultimate and, and jokers is because you are basically always right um, by playing aggressive or like going for um, aces or kings on the top or one of the deuce whereas in regular and progressive um, sometimes it's wrong to gamble so there's like more of an edge because um, it's easier for your opponent to make mistakes than if uh, you are playing jokers or ultimate queen discard the three Wow, all the sixes out. We need a perfect draw. Three outs and seven outs. That's okay. Still more than ten percent. Yeah, Ace King missed, so it was actually a good draw. We just need like Ace or King, and if if I can't improve the bottom row, I would bow anyway or get scooped anyway. And is dead. So two outs for five. I mean two outs for for ace. I would play the deuce if I could, but I need the king and the eight. So more outs because now we have a combo draw in the middle so like we can draw 4 and king ah there is the king so close so close to a nice hand this is like a normal hand easy game Usually, usually that that setup, um, that series of draws is how people uh, draw to trips when they are playing um, OFC with jokers. Usually, it's a draw like that, like some full house, and then either trips or some straight or flush draw, and then. It's pretty common in the Joker version. Because you, you always have aces in something like three, four, five, six, and then last draw. Um, perhaps with a joker, you get the straight and trips, uh, trip aces. Just have four points. Okay, somehow I managed to scoop both.
Oh, um, so the game has ended. So I will just um, record another one. So thanks for watching. See you.